Hi everyone, I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. And want to give a shout out to a recent PayPal donation and for cups of coffee. Thank you so very much. I really appreciate it. God bless you. Yesterday there was a magnitude 3.1 earthquake near Maxwell and Williams, California in the Sacramento Valley. This is Colusa County. It rattled homes and kind of shook people up. Um, there are faults stirring in the Sacramento Valley and, and you wonder is there something larger coming. Here I have an image of what they call the Great Valley Thrust Fault System. This here is Clear Lake and up over here is where the uh, earthquake occurred. Yeah, a lot of blind thrust faults. Meaning that there are faults that can have thrust earthquakes where one side rises up over the other. But they're under the ground so they can't be seen or located. This area, I'll try and bring it up for you. Oops, went too far. Okay, this area was formed and it goes all the way down to Southern California. Let me bring it down some more and bring it over if I can get the mouse to work. It's a really large picture. All right, we'll come down a little bit. Um, this is Santa Cruz, I believe. But anyways, um, it was formed because of the movement of the Pacific Plate sliding underneath the North American Plate. And this area actually formed because of the subduction but this area didn't slide down. It slid sideways vertically, thus creating the valley. No damage was reported, but small items did fall off of shelves. Dishes and windows and doors were probably rattling. In Williams, they said that there was brief shaking and it was felt in doors. Colusa, a faint tremor like a truck passing by. In Yuba City, slight vibration, but barely noticeable. There was over 200 felt reports. Here we have the felt report map on USGS. They don't report them all. Uh, Chico, we got one report there. 51 kilometers to the northeast. So that would be about 31.7 miles. Uh, another report, Oroville. Yeah, they got that dam there. Um, 35 kilometers northeast. So that would be about 21 miles. Uh, to the uh, southeast, uh, Roseville, um, 99 kilometers. So that's 61 and a half miles, yeah, um, southeast. And then to the south, Napa, wow, um, 16, 116 kilometers. So that would be about 72 miles. You know, when I see uh, Oroville and Napa, I think of the earthquakes and that dam damage they had. Or the, um, yeah, they had to rebuild the dam. Anyways, yeah, Napa, they had, when they had their large earthquake, there was a lot of gas fires. Yeah, that's one of the reasons you need a tool to shut off your uh, gas lines if you detect a leak. And also your water lines. Um, you should have a, a tool, which everyone should have, to, uh, yeah, shut off those mains. The Great Valley Fault Zone is a series of low-angle blind thrust faults located along the west side of the Sacramento in San Joaquin Valleys. Um, it is a thrust and strike slip fault system within the Central Valley Tectonic Block driven by compression stress from the Pacific Plate. It underlies um, oh, just under the surface and extends east um, including north-south trending blind thrust faults. The Great Valley Fault Zone is not just one single fault, but includes multiple small segments that likely rupture independently, producing moderate to large earthquakes. They could have a magnitude 6.5 to a 7 in this location. Can you imagine the death and the destruction? There have been swarms in this location, uh, magnitude 3.6 to 6.4, that occurred in the region of Maxwell and Williams 
in late 1943 that are believed to originate in along the Great Valley Fault Zone. Yeah, are you prepared for something large? Yeah, some people there in Maxwell said they didn't feel it, but they were working, so they might have been, you know, being occupied doing something else and didn't notice the light rattle. Uh, if you felt this earthquake, let me know. How long did it last? What did it feel like? What did the motion feel like? Thank you for watching. Please share. Please subscribe. Always be prepared, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.